Hello everyone, in this video we are just going to establish the basic communication between Node MCU module or ESP8266 module with PC through USB cable. Let's get started. So in this video we are just going to establish the communication between Node MCU module and our PC through USB cable. So this is very very simple video and a short video. So the essential basic driver required for establishing this communication is Silicon Labs CP210X driver. So without this driver it is nearly impossible for you to communicate Node MCU with your PC or even you cannot establish an UART communication with the Node MCU without this driver. So this is the first and foremost step for you to do for establishing the communication as well as for programming or for erasing the node MCU programs etc. So let's do that. So I am just connecting the node MCU to my laptop through USB cable that is micro USB cable. It is connected. I am just opening the device manager. You can see it is popped out like this that is CP2102 USB to UART bridge controller is invalid showing up and warning symbol that means the drivers for this particular device is not installed on your PC so you just want to download that driver before starting to work on this node MCU device open the Google and just type in CP210X driver download and this will direct you to silicon labs official website just click on that and in this particular silicon labs driver page just click on the downloads tab and the downloads tab shows you various driver softwares available and in this you just want to download the cp210x vcp windows driver since i am using windows os i am just downloading this if you are a mac user you just want to download this and so on so i am just clicking on this for downloading the driver required for my node mcu you can see it is being downloaded i am going to the downloads folder so here i am just making a folder called downloads and putting it inside the downloads folder i'm just extracting this and moving inside the folder and here you can see there are two versions of the drivers available one is the 64 bit version and another one is the 32 bit version so depending on the os that you are working on that is available in your laptop or PC, you just want to install the drivers required. So in my case, I'm using a 64-bit operating system. So I'm just double clicking on this X64 version of the driver software. Just click on yes. And in the first tab, just click on the next. I accept this agreement, next. You can see the driver is being installed so you can see after some time the driver will be successfully installed on your pc now i'm just opening the device manager you can see this will be popped out like silicon labs cp210x usb to uart bridge and the com number will be displayed right over here in my case the pc com number to which the silicon labs driver or the node mcu is connected is com14 so this is how you can install the CP210X drivers that is Silicon Labs drivers for your Node MCU on your PC. So this is an essential driver required for operating on your Node MCU in any PC. So I hope you learned to install Silicon Labs CP210X driver in this video. See you in the next video. Thanks for watching.